My name is Kusai Mansour Al Turki Al Hiti. I was born in a very small town and beautiful, uh, the, the river uh, Euphrates River, called it Heat, in 1968. I was born in a, a big family with a sister and brother, and I grew up with them and learned from my father and my uncle and my cousin. Because I was in uh, Iraq, and you know Iraq is a very famous country in the civilization and archaeology, I went to archaeology department in College of Arts in Baghdad University, and I spent four years. Uh, I was very happy to study archaeologist, and I learned many things from my uh, professor and my colleague as well. And then, because there is um, there is a, a very very uh, interested uh, department in archaeology, you can say that this is cuneiform writing. Uh, this is uh, I am the first uh, uh, one study in this uh, department. Uh, this is in 1986, and then I finished my master degree as well in cuneiform writing, and also I went to uh, many university in Arab countries, as well as uh, Tunisia University, Libya University to teach. And also I finished my PhD in Tunisia University at the same field in civilization and archaeology. This is why I spent more than 22 years teaching and learning about archaeology in the Middle East, especially for Mesopotamia civilization. Sumerian uh, civilization and Akkadian civilization, this is the very uh, famous civilization in Middle East, especially in Mesopotamia. And because I study when I'm in a bachelor, uh, uh, studied in university, I know that the Sumerian is the fairest civilization in the world. And because the Sumerian civilization in uh, uh, the very, very uh, uh, oldest uh, town is Uruk, there is the beginning of uh, civilization in Somer. The, the excavators found tablets, cuneiform tablets, and they study about it when I'm in uni. I would like to explain about this cuneiform writing. This is before 5,000 years ago. The cuneiform writing is like a sign you can read and write uh, and talk with people. You, you never meet them, but you can understand how to think, how to develop all things for lives and uh, manage many signs and many things in our life. When I arrived here in uh, December 2017, uh, I was uh, surprised uh, that the, the life here in Australia is very developed and the people uh, here is so helpful and friendly. The weather is different and I'm far away from my uh, small family and uh, my big family. It's not easy to forget my uh, small daughter. I, I, I really miss her so much. Uh, until now when I make uh, this interview. Uh, she is so lovely uh, daughter and also my son. It's, I can't uh, believe how I am far away from him until now for more than three years. It's not easy for me. This is very bad. And maybe in the future, I wish I can uh, enjoy my, my life here when I have my permanent resident and I can find job with my uh, field in university. I also, I work as a relief teacher in Islamic College here and Langford uh, College here in, in Perth. This is very important to me to keep. I would like to, if, if, I, if, if I can advise the, the government to look uh, at the uh, immigrate and the people come from overseas Australia as a refugee, like like my case, we need to just uh, try to, to choose a good qualificate for these people. And look, is this uh, is this person good for Australia or not? Is this is this people come here in Australia just because need support? or just needs, needs safe. For me, I need safe and I need, I am interested to help Australian and interested to help a uh, student here, sorry, teach them, uh, let them near, uh, learn about uh, uh, archeology, span about civilization. And I am so interested to, to show them 
uh, how people live and uh, live together before maybe 10,000 years ago, 20,000 years ago, because I know Australia is very good uh, place for uh, for study, uh, for, for for make make a, a, a good co communities, a multicultural uh, civilization. This is very good for uh, Australian people and as well for overseas Australia.